How are we doing, everyone? The title screen kind of creepy. Oh, I need to do this up so my green shirt doesn't show. That's better. How's everyone doing? Yeah, now we're in black space. The title screen's gone creepy. Hey, River, how you doing? So, yeah. Let's get back into it. Pretty good, to be honest. That's great to hear. Come on. Let's, let's get into this. I've had such a great time playing this game. I need more games like this. Yeah, pick up the flower crown. I'm not sure what other games are like anything comparable to this. Look like this, Undertale, and then like I don't know. Hey, scribble people. Pitter patter, pitter patter. Pitter patter, pitter patter. It's a lot of pitter patter. That's a lot of pitter pattering. Oh, there he is. There's Basil. <laughs> oh, thank goodness you're here, Amori. I thought I was going to be stuck here forever. I can't believe you came here to save me. I missed you so much. Yeah, cut him down. Oh, Shadow Basil. Sonny, you've been running away from the truth for so long. How long will you keep running? What's the truth? I won't let the cycle repeat itself. I... I won't let you leave me, Sonny. Not again. Ooh. Oh, okay. That happened. That was a thing that that happened. Sunny. If you won't face the truth, then face me. Face the suffering you've caused for the people you love. The pain of knowing what you've lost. The hatred of yourself for being... The hatred of yourself for being too cowardly to change anything about it. Let these feelings devour you here. Until your insides rot. Nice. Okay, calm down. You try to calm down, but your lungs fought to breathe. Sunny, all those times that I reached out to you, why didn't you answer? Uh, attack? Did nothing. You promised me that we face this together, but you left me all alone. Run? Can't run. Focus. Nope, can't do that either. You tried to focus, but nausea overwhelmed you. Hey, Sarah! Eerie. Yeah, we're getting into the creepy arc of this game now. We're going to learn the truth behind what's happened and stuff. Um, Persist. Nope, can't. We literally can do nothing against Demon Battle. Or whatever he is. He tried to persist, but you couldn't hold steady. If we can't face it together, 
At least we can be together here. I can't do anything. Sunny, I'll trap you down here with me forever. Oof. So we're like in Sunny's subcon- like deep subconscious, where something's hidden away. Hey False, how you doing? Okay, nothing off to the side, just so going to follow the footsteps. Yeah, so it's like deep inside Sunny's mind, his subconscious. This is like what's under the dream layer that he's like- he built a dream world to like cover everything up and now we've- broken through and found all the stuff that he's pushed deep down and repressed. And we're gonna find out what actually happened, why his sister's dead, what happened to Basil, everything. Hey, Devso, welcome back! What's the hands? Oh, they're making a bridge for me. Oh, I fell over, I think. Oh, I think we blacked out. God, the art on this is so good. And there's Amori. So Amori's like the dream world version of us. Uh, a sperm? No, the hands! Sussy hands. <laughs> that you've chosen to live that way. I wonder. Can you really call that living? Yeah, Amori is just how Sunny wants to be. Yeah, like the like Amori is Sunny's like ideal version of himself. Leave me here. There's no hope left for me. Oh no, the hands come in to get me. The hand got me. Doesn't look like that on your small phone screen. <laughs> what in the name of God are you playing, man? So this is Omori. It's a game that I kept seeing. Like, once I did Undertale, it's a game that kept popping up and I kept seeing. And it was free on Xbox, so... And a lot of people kind of put this in the same genre as Undertale. So I thought I'd give it a go. And I'm... I've been thoroughly enjoying this game. Omori. Omori. Wake up. There's light coming from the ceiling. Do you think it's a way out? Omori. You're so heavy. Okay, but what about Persona? I played Persona off stream. I started playing it off stream the other night when I was just having some chill time while, um, Wife was playing Bear and Breakfast. Come on, up the stairs you go. Um, but the little bit I played of Persona, really, really enjoyed it. Really nice game. Like I'd seen so many people talking about it, I thought, well, it's free. I'll give it a go. A morning. Dude, thank goodness you're awake. Are you hurt at all? I'll try and pull you towards this white light at the top of the staircase. I get a really nice warm feeling from it. So basically in the dream world, Amori is like Sunny's the real person. Amori's like the embodiment of what Sunny wants to be. 
and all the other characters are the characters from his life. Uh, uh, it's free. Try it such a good game, and Golden is that much better. Cool. So, you've got three main party members. This Basil, who went missing, and you've had to find find him. And then there's Mari, who's your sister, who is trapped up to always be on a picnic blanket. I think she died in real life. Younger versions of the characters in the real world, yeah. Let's go up together. Basil went missing because of the truth. Walk to the light. You'll see. Okay. All will be revealed, apparently. I'm looking forward to it, because you don't really get a lot of what's going on throughout the game. It's all revealed at the end here, I think. But the gameplay and artwork is playing some Snap later. Um, I might, if we finish this before the end, if we finish Amori before the end of my stream, I might throw some Snap on. Oh, those are hands! Either that or Hydra sperm that have many heads. Could be either. Um, but the gameplay and the artwork and music in this game are stunning. Can't see the fingers well. <laughs> So is this, this is us going up through all the layers of subconscious, I guess. Oh, this is deep well music. So this is us bringing Basil back up to the conscious, up to the the subconscious that he's made. To hide everything else, I'm guessing. Oh, hey, it's everyone else. Oh, wait a sec. Bit veg. This is your first playthrough, right? Yeah, this is my first playthrough. Why? Have I done something wrong? Have I done something horribly, horribly wrong? So here's, here's everyone. It's Kel. Mari off her picnic blanket. Interesting. Hero. Not really, but you did the second route that you usually aren't supposed to do. Oh. Oh, did I go the wrong way somewhere? Did I choose a wrong choosing? Don't adventure, right? Just the two of us. Is this meant to be, this part's meant to be different, I take it then. We can rest now, Mori. All our friends are here. And so in this you can't see the truth. Oh damn! I did wrong! You don't know all Kel, that's why it's different. At the beginning of the game, he's supposed to answer the door. Oh yeah, I didn't answer the door. I didn't answer the door because I thought it was going to be a... a demon trying to get in or something because like there's that spooky bit just before and then the door rings i'm like mm -mm, i ain't trusting that nope nope not trusting that oh but i was meant to do that so i don't get to see the truth i might just have to look up an amori like amori true ending or something because i don't think i'll put i don't know i might play through this again i probably wouldn't play through it again on stream because it takes a lot bedtime like, it takes a long time to get- this is a long game. 
So is this like the bad ending? One day left. Yeah, I didn't realize how long it was when I started it, <laughs> but I'm glad I did. Hmm. Oh, Facebook! Facebook! What are you spooking there for? It's sort of a bad ending. Okay, you have a new message. Hey, Sonny, it's mommy. Tomorrow's the big day. The will be here first thing tomorrow morning. I gave them the key so I don't freak out if you see them. I'm going to finish wrong and say, when I see your things today, I'll pick on car up front. I oh, know, I like this route more because there's something you can do in this route. Oh, okay. Just can't decide when you're ready. Okay, that's it for now. Mommy loves you. Bye, honey, bye. What's on my to-do list? Organize your old belongings. Yeah. Looks toys. You reach into a large cardboard box. Did I tell you your old, your old small pinwheel? What did I get this time? A guide to our solar system book. In the in the bookie box it goes. Benefits of Tofu Book. <laughs> Old building blocks. Meh. They can go that way. Orange Joe's Scratch and Sniff Book. An old smelly sock. A debit. Old plastic cash register. You can see in this part of that stuff that inspired things in the dream world. Yeah. Old dry modeling clay. An old can of Orange Joe. A miniature toy piano. Oh, we've got to keep the good toy piano. Can't be throwing that away. The book to sniff soda. <laughs> Captain Space Boy action figure. Space Boy slash Space Boyfriend slash Space Husband slash Space Divorcee. I don't know where he's now. Sweetheart, get in the fucking bin. Sweetheart gets right in the fucking bin. You reach a large cardboard box. Tangled a bunch of wires. Metal Jackson ball. You never know when you get any jacks. They make great caltrops. Your broken kite. Oh yeah, it was, it was Kite Boy, wasn't there? Sprout Mole plush. Gotta keep the Sprout Mole. Pet Rock Strategy Guide. <laughs> Kid in his kite book. And then do I do I have to keep on do I have to sort everything? Do I have to carry until the box is empty? Of 
cut so how did you do it like three times just put everything in the trash oh does it not matter okay a single puzzle piece playing undertale omori oh, i see <laughs> aiden poke yeah we're uh, at the end of omori apparently Slinky, everyone loves a slinky. Hungry Humphrey. <laughs> You're still on level three in ap apirophobia. No idea what that is. Oh, is that that blocks game? There's nothing left in the cardboard box. You saw three year old belongings. You could have done better, but it doesn't really matter too much. Hey, hey, ghosty ghosts. How you doing? How you doing there? Oh. It's getting real demony in here. Now why doesn't the demon appear, appear behind me in the reflection, huh? Huh? The little demon -y ghosty thing following me around. I gotta save it now. I can't believe I got the bad ending. <laughs> the fear of eternity or infinity. Oh, okay. Oh, he doesn't want to go in there. Okay. Yeah, it's Amori's reflection, yeah. Even though I'm playing as Sunny. Yeah, some of these backroom games look pretty fun. He no want to go outside. Let's go back to bed then. Sleep. I sleep. Oh, this isn't the bad ending. Pepe la. Is it not? Oh no, it's looking pretty bad to me. Back in white space. So that was him just like taking over completely, just Sunny just disappeared. Welcome to white space. You've been living here for as long as you can remember. Oh, okay. Interesting. Giant maze that makes puzzles every now and again. And the floor is glass. Such an artist. You stared at the screen. <laughs> Can I, can I not? You learned red hand. <laughs> Deal big damage four times. Awesome. That's pretty cool. 
I like dealing big damage four times. Everyone's jumping. Hi, Amory. Hoping you come by soon. The order keeps randomly cutting out for you. Anyone else having that problem? Wanna play cards with us? We're just about to start another game. Oh, whoops. Never mind. Oh man, what the heck, Aubrey? You must have all the cards. I was winning too. Hey there, Cold. No need to get angry. All good on Twitch. Okay, let me just quickly check my YouTube. Stream health? Stream is healthy, excellent. Ah, okay. Not sure why that's happening. Yeah, showing everything is okay. Hmm. You need to get angry. It's just a game after all. Don't give me that hero. You know, it's not because like you were losing. Kel's always picking on me. Doesn't he have anything better to do? One day, I'm gonna pull life jam all over his hair and see how he likes it. Those hands are indeed sperm, okay. <laughs> now you spit on your hand too. It's a brother's handshake. Shake my hand now, do my honor brother. Okay. You shook Kel's wet hand. Ew. <laughs> that sailed it. We're now destined to be bros forever. And that makes Hero your honorary brother now. Who? Hehe. <laughs> Can we go? Can't leave without your friends. Come on, guys, let's go. Yes. Let's go. Going out, Amori. Here's your allowance for today. 6,000 clams. I've got so many clams. Not cutting out on your phone. Oh, okay. It must be a. Hey, look, Basil's back. Amori, Basil. Oh, hello, Aubrey. Hello, everyone. How are you all doing today? Kel's being mean to me again. Oh, no. Not again. How could he? Psh, I'm not being mean. Aubrey's just being all whiny. Well, Kel, you just made a very convincing point. <laughs> now I don't know who to believe. Believe me. No, believe me. <laughs> Fell down, you two. Why does it always have to be like this? Chin up, hero. Look at you being more responsible. I really like that about you. <laughs> oh, come on, Mari. Not now. Oh, Harry, you know I'm just teething. You're so cute when you get all flustered. Do you want to show us your photo album now, Basil? Uh, okay. There's nothing amazing. Oh, Basil, stop dating yourself. I'm sure it'll be great. You're right, Aubrey. Sorry. I try to believe in myself more. Here, this way we can all see. Oh, you can read them. These fetters are also charming, Basil. You really had to capture the moment. Thanks. I didn't take all of them, though. Mara likes to steal my camera sometimes. Only sometimes. When I look through these fetters, I feel like I have friends like you. Before I met you all, I knew what it was like to be alone. But you've all taught me so much. How to care for others and how to care for myself, too. 
Oh, Basil, you're so sweet. We all feel the same way about you. Yeah, we'd do anything for each other. No matter what happens, we've got each other's backs. Uh-oh. I'm feeling a group hug coming. You know what, hero? You're right. I think I do too. Huh? Group hug? Right now? I'll start. <laughs> hey, don't leave me and Mari out of this. Come on, you too, Amori. Get in close, everyone. Isn't this exactly the same thing that happened just before we went missing at the start of the game? <laughs> now that would have been a good photo. It's okay. We don't always need a picture. <laughs> yeah, Amori's as like... It's not just about the memories. It's about us. I know that we'll all be friends for a really long time. We'll always be together. Like one big happy family. Like a repeat, yeah. Aw, oh, you guys really are the best. I'll cherish you all forever. You got a flower crown. Oh, I'm gonna put the flower, flower crown on. Wow, hundred heart and twenty-five juice. B -b 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 bonus. Big boy bonus. So is that why Amori's so stoic? Because Sonny's ideal version of himself is just completely devoid of all emotion? Let's go see what's going on at Basil's house. All the flowers are completely watered. So this way I don't get to find out what Amor has gone through to make him so like that. Okay. This is what happened, isn't it? We went to Basil's house after that part. Got a tulip hair stick. And a rose hair clip. And a cactus hair clip. And the Gladiolus hairband. Who was meant for who again? Gladiolus was Aubrey. Hero was... No, Kel was Cactus. Well, are you supposed to do the other route first? Oh, okay. Well... I did a boo-boo. And the hero is Rose. And the has got the flower crown, so it doesn't really need anything else. Yeah, I did a little oopsie, I did. I did indeed do a little oopsie. So where am I meant to be going? Nah, yeah, we've seen a few album. We're cool, dude. We're cool. Okay, so there's nowhere in particular I'm going to be going, just I can explore. I can literally do whatever. Huh. 
Huh, okay. So we can just go wherever the hacking heck we want. There's some cool exclusive stuff to this though. Oh, is there? Like the thing that you really like, but don't know if you want to see it or not. Did I go to the beach? Yes, but I can't remember where it is. We built sandcastles. Was it up to... T oh! It wants me to go back in there. I'm going to explore it first, though. No, not that one. It's sort of hard to do, but also not. Okay. Well, if it's just a case of around a son of a bitch. Hey, Alex. How you doing? Welcome in. Um, yeah, if, so if there's anything I'm meant to be doing here, or like any secrets I can obtain, please say. Because I don't know anything, and seeing as I've kind of messed everything up by getting the second ending first, I have no clue about what's going on. Uh, basically, what you have to do is go to the part leading up to Humphrey and collect these music sheets. Then go to Lost Library and beat some bosses, then go to White Space. Okay. To Humphrey! Shit, how do we get to Humphrey? Um... Let's go deep well, don't we? Too deep well. Is this like a secret boss then or something? Deep well, let's go. <laughs> Pluto is an absolute giga chad. Oh yeah, Pluto is the best Amori character. Right, so you go up here and the toilet you have to go down isn't there. Deeper well. What beach are you talking about, false? To keep exploring around the teleports, okay. Where are the teleport things? This train in vast forest takes you to a new area. Oh, okay. Oh, there's a whirlpool here. Oh, let's go back to last resort. No, no. Here we go. Teleport things. That's where we need to go. I don't think I have, actually. Train in vast forest that takes you to a beach. I'm not sure if I've been there. I can't remember. The vast forest part was a long time ago. 
Oh, the dead tree that gave me the extra stuffs. Oh, that's a point. Right, we need... And oh, then... Mm. Do the damage. If the foe is angry, greatly just turn. If the foe is happy, when the more is sad. Oh, okay, there isn't one for when I'm happy. Okay, cool, cool, cool. The stare, you reckon? It reduces all the foe stats, it's pretty cool. Should I, okay, should I watch the first ending before getting this ending? Is this ending going to make any sense to me if I haven't seen the first ending? Should I just go YouTube the ending? Oh, that there... you got sheet music. I got sheet music. How many pieces of sheet music is there to collect? Got a rain cloud. You never did this route? Well, I know there's some, there's sort of some stuff here that'll make more sense if you know the ending. Okay, there's three sheets. Well, that's two. Should we should should I just bring up a YouTube video of the ending and watch the proper ending? It really doesn't matter the most though, okay. I'll do this and then I'll look up the ending another time then probably. I can't believe I'm such a dumbass that I got the other ending. Okay, so we need to find one more sheet, do we? Give the music, please. For being too afraid to open the door does to a streamer. <laughs> Make one decision at the start of the game, and now you're... That's <laughs> how it goes. He spent so long looking for these sheets, he had to find, look up where they were. Well, I've been through all the warpy things. I presume there's the num out here. Well, I don't think any of them are here, are they? Okay, I must have missed one back in there then. Must have missed one in here somewhere. I swear I went through all of the... I'm going through all of the warps, though. Is 
They went all the way through this left warp. All through every direction. Hmm. Go to the other teleports that were near the beginning. I thought I went through all of them. Let's go back. Since you didn't go outside, what did you do in the house? Um, went back to bed. I kind of like did it, did the spooky bit. Because there was normally like, you get up, you do your chore, there's a spooky bit, and you go back to sleep. So I never went outside. I didn't even know there was an outside. The sunshine buried her when she was here. And this just goes back to... Yeah, let's just go back in here. I must have missed something. Somewhere. Sit this one. Take jobs on boring. <laughs> boring. This is why you had to look it up. Yeah, because I got those one here that I got. And down here was a watermelon. Oh, hang on, I can go through this teleport here. I'm a big dumb. Got him. Got the sheet music. Okay. Swear you made the same mistake. <laughs> I went down there, I got the watermelon, and I just came straight back up. I didn't even see the teleport there. Oh my god. <sighs> FML. And then we need to go to the library. Where was that? It's hard to see you didn't notice it. At least I'm not the only one. I can take a little comfort in that. Well, hi there. <laughs> it's the hit channel. <laughs> if you're a fan of British comedy, then you'll you'll know who that is. Hello, children. <laughs> Sweetheart's Castle. Ah, yeah. May I interest you in a curiosity? Another place. You may have heard of it. Goes by many names. The Dark Void, the Deep Pit, the Shadowy Chasm. Here in the Deep Well we call it the Abyss. Just past the end of this highway. Would you like me to take you there? Yeah. I think. Oh, I haven't been here. This is all my keys. Z. But I mean, we've got all the letters. We did the whole, we did the hangman. Oh. What happens if you get all the things on the hang and you complete the hangman? This is just where all the keys are. What happens if you collect all the keys? Right here. 
you want to go back to deep well? Yeah. You get a goofy surprise. Oh, now I kind of want to get all the keys to find this goofy surprise. <laughs> How many are we missing? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Six, seven. So we're missing seven keys. I don't know. Let's find them. Let's find the keys, why not? I mean, we've got the whole map unlocked, it can't take that long. And it can't take that long. So that, where's the first one? Near a cast off bridge. Okay, I'm gonna go through a... Get a quick coffee while you guys think about that. Near a cast off bridge and beneath a trap door. I'm guessing the trap door is at Sweetheart's Castle anyway. Um, near a cast off bridge, right? I know. I'll be back in a couple of minutes.
I'm back. Okay. So, uh, near a cast off cartridge. Beneath a trap door. Cast off cartridge and the dump. Well, let's just Google it. Omori D. Key. Garbage container in the junkyard. Right, okay, cool. <laughs> yeah, you Googled it. <laughs> Right, other world. Yes. Shouldn't I mean we've got Pluto and it shouldn't take too long to get these keys. Up here, wasn't it, I think? Oh, it's Wiggler! It's Wiggler! Surprised to see you here, children. My dream of owning a transportation station has taken me all around the universe, but it's still nice to come back home every now and then. Sometimes I miss my friend. Like the Earth here. The Earth and I go way back. All your confined solar system, we saw through the galaxy after galaxy, decimating everything in our path. Still think very fondly of those times. What's that, Earth? Hmm, I see. The Earth tells me that she has been keeping watch on you, your journey. She says that your growth has inspired her and she wishes to challenge you to a battle. But her last battle was cut short. Perhaps we can finish it now. What do you say? Um. Yeah? Okay. This will be our final fight. Show me everything you have. Okay. Sad poem. Attack. Megaphone. Attack. I will stare him next turn, yeah. That's all. It's best to get the reduced damage in first. Oh, he gave everyone the sads. Holy shit, 419 damage. Um, get that jam. <laughs> Monga dub. Yeah, I'm just getting one shot by everything he they throw at us. Um, let's go with the red hands, I suppose. Megaphone. I can't beat this. Like we're getting one shot by everything. Everything is one-shotting us. And I really didn't do that much damage. <laughs> we, we can't win this. We can't win this fight. <sighs> we might as well just attack. We're not going to win. Like, it's a one-shot every time.
I saved not too long ago. I don't think I saved directly before this, but I think I saved back at um, when we got outside of Deep Well. It's like 500 on damage! How are you meant to- how are you meant to be that? How are you meant to be that? Oh, it retries the actual fight. So we're just going to level the hell up. I mean, let's... So we've got the Earth and Pluto. Yeah, I think I need to go way, way higher level than this. Uh, Earth set off a nuke. Like level 50, yeah, I was like, there's no way I'm, I'm doing this. Give everyone the sads. I'm just going to have to attack until we die and then say no to retry and just load up again. Music's a banger, though. Hey, Paul, how are you doing? Yeah, we, we are nowhere near ready for that. Let's not retry. We're just going to have to um, reload the saves. Yeah, we saved back at the underwater highway, so it's not too bad. We can just go back here. <laughs> yes, other world. Save the part where you do the chores IRL and doing the boss, so I had to reply to the Oh no, you kept getting save. Oh no. That is the worst. Right, let's try that again and not get into an epic boss fight, huh? Let's let's um let's give that a go. Right now that's the, that's up to the space boys. We don't need to go there. We need to go this way. This is the way. Junkyard! Right, so apparently there's a key in here somewhere. Oh yeah, we can't go up that way. So is it in one of these? Hmm. 
Let's kill these mixtapes. Okay, this way? Oh, did, did, did it disappear? Die, mixtape, die. Uh, I think I'm close to it. Okay. Scarethrow. They call me Scarethrow. I'm stuck in the ground. Throw things at me and hear a strange sound. Okay. Oh, this is literally... Wasn't that fun? Can I get another turn try? You can stop now. Oh no, we're going all the way. It's really starting to hurt. Oh no, we're doing this. Please stop it. No. Don't stop now, I'm going to have to report you to the authorities. Do it. Do it. Do it, no balls. Please stop. I'm asking you politely. Is this like a secret boss where if I just keep doing it, he's gonna get mad and come at me? Stop it. Stop it right now, I say. Huh. Words just mean nothing to you, I see. Remember when people used to listen to me? You know, back in high school, everyone used to make fun of me for having no legs. You don't think you did this? <laughs> this thing is like, oh look, it's Scarethrow, standing in the same spot like he always does. This is him for target practice. Oh god, what's going <laughs> This is going to be some super hard boss I'm not prepared for. Ooh. Kids are so mean. Like, really, really horrible. Hehe. <laughs> You're just throwing balls at me. That's what I even have to complain about. This is nothing compared to what I used to go through. Wow, we're learning the childhood trauma of a scarecrow. It always starts small, you know? First it was rubber bands, then rubber balls. I remember one could even throw a desk at me. Damn. Yeah, that's right. I took an entire desk head on. I used to tell myself if I could survive that, I could survive anything. I'm liking getting some, some some deep lore on the Scarecrow. Now see, if I had hands, we could play catch. Here, throw me the ball. I'll try to catch it. Darn. I guess it slipped right through my fingers. <laughs> Scarecrow lore! Don't worry, I'll get it next time. Oh, I almost had that one. I was really close, did you see? Come on, try it again. 
<laughs> oh man, good times. Could it be that I don't have real arms either? I wonder. God, he's having an existential crisis. <sighs> I wish I could move. <laughs> I could travel the world, settle down with someone I love, start a family. How long does this go on for? <laughs> no, it's dangerous to dream so recklessly. Why must I be stuck here? Am I not allowed to have anything nice? Why is fate so cruel? What did I do wrong? It's not fair. I hate this. Ah, uh, what's this feeling? I think I'm crying. Am I crying? I don't have tear ducts, so I can't tell. <sighs> Just forget I said any of this, okay? They call me Scarethrow. I'm stuck on the ground. Throw things at me and hear a strange sound. Oh, I think. Okay, I think it just loops. But that was, I loved that. I I very much enjoyed Scarethrow Deep Lore. Oh, I just want this key. Where is the key? Where is the key? Oh, we found some tofu. That was so long. <laughs> it did go on. No, that's the way out. This is the way out, isn't it? Donut. I really don't know where the heck can hack this key is. Got bacon pan. Here at lunch snack time. Go back. I think I missed it. Okay. I did presume that I'd missed it because it's been a while. Tofu soda. Ooh, nice bit of life jam. Nom nom. Got some jacks. There it is. I see it. Okay, we've got D. Beneath the trap door. Okay, so beneath the trap door is going to be um, Meteor Ball. I mean, that's got to be a good weapon for Kel, right? Literal Meteor. What are the chances? But it literally puts all my stats down. Okay. Maybe not. Oh, it's actually here in the other world? Oh! Ooh, piece of candy. You're gonna be my guide to the keys, River. <laughs> you are my guide. Hey. 
I suppose. I'll do my very best. <laughs> I'm only joking. Aubrey learned beat down. Aubrey learned how to smack a bitch. I don't know. I don't know if this didn't come up here. Aubreyland violence. Oh, I haven't got the joke book, have I? Let's sit and stare at the incredibly close moon. Snack time is really good. Skills, hero. Uh, instead of tea time. Heals all friends for forty percent of their heart. Can be used up. Wow, that is really cool. Yeah, that's really good. You got a hot dog. That's a friggin' plane. Shark plane! I've never seen that. How did I miss that the first time around? Shark plane. I obviously didn't come up here, so I missed out on that weapon. Yeah, we took down a plane. That's right, we took down a freaking plane. Run. Toilet ramen. Okay. So it's in... Me and the boys only take down a plane. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we need to go out of this area, of the junkyard, don't we? We need to go back to other world. So we can get out quickly through here, can't we? We go round. Frozen Lake? Okay, cool. Hey! <laughs> so Google told me, we trust Google. We trust Google. I meant, am I meant to be, like, I didn't see this part at all last time. Got a blankie. Oh, I was gonna say if I were to get through there, let's not bother. <laughs> What's in here? Would you like to moonwalk? Yeah. That was incredibly fun. Oh hey, it's this place. You guys want to get in? Mr. Jawson told me the password once so I could complete one of his errands. I love these guys, they're loads of fun. I mean... That was awesome. What's the password? Hey ho, it's me, Hero. Password is... Hero, my man. Welcome, welcome. Doors unlocked, come right on in. He sells at home, kiddos. Any friend of here is a friend of mine. 
Do you want to lend to your friends? Yeah, why not? Seem like cool dudes. Everyone gave five juice. Space Pirate! It's in! <laughs> Time out. What did you do? Nothing. Just try eating tables over there. What? Try eating the tables? You can do that? Oh, I see. Tables are made out of bread. <sighs> That's a cool little thing. is a lowly crow. Doesn't seem to notice me. Bread tables, wouldn't that just break? I mean, depends how hard you put the bread. What's down here? Oh, this is Sprout Mold Home. Oh no, this is this is a different Sprout Mole colony. I've got a computer part. Bless you. Very big TV. Batsy. Why have I got a computer part? What does that do? Most horse, one place, first place. <laughs> oh, recycling machine, yes, of course. That's where you put all the cardboard and that stuff, yeah. I don't want to do a mission. What you got? What do you want? Oh, it's the care package I'm going to be giving. No, no tofu in here. Got a light jam out of it. I'll take it. Dude just ate 99 tofu. Okay, that's enough exploring. Go to what we're meant to be doing. At least I presume this is where we're meant to be going. Did I even ever come this way? Wow, well, miss, you sure are at all. Thank you, little one. I'm more, it's more a hassle most of the time, but I do get a better view of the stars. What, being tall is a, isn't a hassle? Everything's better when you're tall. One day I'm going to be as tall as you. Yeah, sure, girl, keep dreaming. Okay. Starfruit soda! Actually, let's just run from these. <laughs> Bye -bye. God, it's a scarecrow. Oh, it's a scarecrow. Ah, uh, stranger, thank you for having time to talk with me. Apologize, my friend, I was burning you with a task I can't complete in my own capabilities. Quite recently, suddenly a rogue planet burst across the sky at an alarmingly fast pace. My three dearest friends, planets, can flew off in separate directions. My three friends are crows. You oh. No. I am not going on a fetch quest for a scarecrow. Schmores. Right, I think I'm going to be going to the right, aren't we?
What are all, what's with all these random tentacles poking out of the ground? It's another mole place. A little campsite, Cattail Field. Oh, you think it's like a junkyard entrance? Thanks, we got to Otherworld. So here's junkyard entrance. Okay. Oh, I found Ducky Jr. Cool duffel bag. Just says, ooh. Jock jams. <laughs> wow. He's a wacky waving a playable on flaming tube man. Hey, I found him. Yeah, I get a present. A dandelion. Yeah, G, beneath the trap door. Yeah. Actually, let's save it. We haven't saved it in a while. What are you doing? I'm trying to find all the keys. We've only got like six keys to get, so we might as well get them all. It seems to be if you go down to the abyss with all the keys, like I went to the abyss and like all the other key all the keys I've collected are there, so I'm presuming something happens if you collect all of the keys. So we need beneath the trap door, trapped in a pink cage, at the end of a plank, surrounded by goo, at the end of a map in a field of white snow, and past the end of the road. I hope there's none that are like in Humphrey that I missed because I can't get back to Humphrey now. It's invaded Zim. Sorry, invaded Zar. Right. Let's Google. Let's Google it. I'm already jiki. Snow Globe Mountain Igloo. You can find the Amori G key inside the Snow Globe Mountain Igloo. Note the G key is Hikikomori exclusive. Where the hell is Snow Globe Mountain? I don't think I've been there. <coughs> Where's Frozen Lake? Inside the you see the trap door. Go back to the Frozen Lake and look inside the igloo where you'll see trap door. No, it said something about Space Boy, so I thought it was other world, my bad. Okay, where? Okay, where is that place, though? Igloo. I don't think I've been there. 
Snow Globe Mountain. Amori Snow Globe Mountain. Snow Globe Mountain is also known as Fro Frozen Forest. Um, it's an optional location exclusive to the Omori route. A snowy mountain that can be accessed through Frozen Lake. Igloo after obtaining batteries from Pink Beard. Only accessible during the Omori route, it can be accessed after speaking to Pink Beard where he will give you batteries and ask you to find Captain Space Boy. These batteries can be used in the igloo. After using them and letting the plastic fish finish singing, a trap door will open and allow you to go downstairs. Summoning circle will transport you to a white field. Running to edge will take you to Snow Globe Mountain. There is also the Y key in the field. Okay. Okay, one day left. Amori and his friends must visit Space Beard's Space Boyfriend's house and speak to Pink Beard. Okay, so we do have to be here because this is where Space Boyfriend's house is, isn't it? Isn't it? Yeah. This is Space Boyfriend's house up here. <laughs> this is why I didn't bother getting all the keys. So you can only get all the keys in this in this ending. Bah! Where has that boy run off to now? I wonder that the sweetheart girl wouldn't bring another bit of trouble. Have you seen my son? The little cat and space boy, but I'm not sure where he goes by nowadays. There's always something going on with that bird brain. Space Pirate Chief, my most trusted advisor. Well, did you find him? Looking a little grim, Captain. He may be gone for good this time, but I did find these. Some are locked in the first route. Ah. Huh? What's this? Batteries! I should find my son. Bobbing batteries. This won't help find Captain Space Boy. Hmm. Or will it? <sighs> Sorry, Captain. I'll keep looking. Even if he's a pain in the butt sometimes. Ah, where's that where we're after now? I've warned this you know. I've got batteries! Okay, so I've got the batteries, so now I need to go to... Frozen Forest? Did it say? Heading to Frozen Lake, where's Frozen Lake? South of the Otherworld campsite is a giant frozen lake surrounded by a surface blanket with tons of snow. Okay, so it's still in this area. So south of here. Oh, right of this area? So right then south, I take it. Somehow. Not that way. I do I have to cut through all of those cones? Is that how I get there? No. Okay. So I've got to go right and then south now. They're cool. A message in a bottle. Do you want to read it? Yeah, why not? Sure. When the moon hits your eye, like a big pizza, that's... a more. <laughs> that's amazing. You put the message in a bottle back in the lake. That's... truly brilliant. Loamy loam loam. Loamy loam. Is loamy. I had to beat this thing to go through, okay.
We're gonna do this. We're getting all the keys. We might not. <laughs> it means we might not actually finish the game tonight. Depending how it takes to get all the keys and do this secret thing in the library. Yeah, I definitely didn't come down here. There's a little ghost. So we've got to go in here, put batteries in the singing fish. Gonna be another stream or two. Damn! I took all this one final! It's not final. Library stuff's gonna be quicker. I mean, I don't think keys should be, take too long. It's literally just running to places, grabbing them. A refrigerator, but why? Cold soup, but why? Oh, hi there, Jiki. Okay, apparently there's another key in this area as well. It said there's another key in this snowy area, didn't it? said the V key was here as well, I think? Mori V key. Not V key. No, I've already got the V key. Which key was it in a... Y key. The Y key is here in a field of snow. Ah, uh, Y key, Y key, Y key, Y key. W X Y. Why the Y key is only only available on alternate route? Entrance area of Snowglow Mountain. Leave the igloo, and you'll find it in the vast forest next to some snowy pine trees in the northeast. Right, northeast, let's go northeast then. Hey, there it is. Got it. See, they've only got like, what, four left to get now? Is there any other in Snow Globe Mountain? Alright, that one was quick. <laughs> that was that was a quick one. Snow Globe Mountain. So this is an area you can only access through this route. Snow Globe Mountain. Right. Is there a point of getting here? Oh, you actually get to fight Space X husband as a secret boss. You 
can get to another fight with SpaceX husband. That's all you get here. Yeah, I'll come back to it. We'll come back to that, it's fine, Tor. Okay, so what's the next key? Next key is J trapped in a pink cage. In Sweetheart's Castle, head right when you exit the dungeon area, go through the big door and you'll find a kitchen somewhere in Spratmall's try to hire you as sous chef. Ignore this and head to the door straight up, go down the big red carpet, find a cage with a J in floating inside, switch to Aubrey, smash it open. Okay, so we need to go to the castle. So we've got J, R, and U, X, and Z. Didn't I pick up Z? Like, of course I didn't save, did I? So, right, Z, we know where he is. That's in the abyss. So we need to go back to Sweetheart's Castle. Right. Lifetime. Is there a... No, there isn't a Pluto's place here. Okay. So, Sweetheart's Castle is... Oh, how do I get to there again? So, I'll save it. Higher fly for that's it. <clears throat> Just trying to where all these areas are. <laughs> This place looks a hell of a lot different to what it was. Lost Library. Red hands. That's a lot of damage. Funny. 
I'm sorry. So this is the place where I'm meant to be to do the special thing, right? With the sheet music. Right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, why don't we do that now? Seeing as we're here... It all feels hollow here. Aubrey! No grandfather clock. Okay, maybe not all reads knock it down. I've got to read all the books. Okay. Everyone is over again today. Special occasion is Saturday morning. From seven to eleven a group of six friends <coughs> eat a delicious home breakfast and watch TV together. The most enjoyable part of every week. Looks at the clock. 8 a.m. Two hours left. You'll be able to watch with everyone else until 10 a.m. when his shooter arrives. Grimaces. What he thought would be a rewarding hobby has been nothing more than a nuisance. Instead of watching the shows the rest of his friends, he'll be the only one to miss out. If only he could watch the last hour with everyone else. If only he didn't have to play the violin. Something opened. A grand piano. The word Amori is etched across the center. Do you want to play your sheet music? Yeah, why not? Three duels for three bosses, I take it. All right, let's try this then. Oh, it's him. You are falling. Ten turns left. Oh, really? Sad poem. Megaphone. Oh. You have to be all three in ten turns. Oh. I can't. Oh, of course, because he's afraid he can't. It's not actually that bad. Oh, okay. So we just go in with the red hands. Hey, Cyan, how you doing? You go and make everyone not afraid. How do we do that again? Spooky colorful game of fun times. <laughs> How do, how do we make them not... I've got to affect them with some sort of... Okay. Toy. Well, if I just do it on him, then he can make everyone... Right, now he's angry. Two whole damage. Right, so now I can sad poem him. And now he can megaphone. And you can do a cook. No, he can't.
everyone angry now. Oh, he could, they can't be inflicted with emotion? Okay. Good to know. How much damage have we done to him already? Oh, wow, nothing. Okay, right, let's hit him with the red hands. Attack. Attack. Cook. You alright? Okay. Right. Yeah. I think I got seven turns left. I haven't even got this guy down to a quarter. Hit him with the red hands again. The running gun. Cook. <clears throat> Is anything that I think I must? I need to be a lot higher level than this. I think. I think I need to be a much higher level than this. Is this going to last stream for Amori? Um, I don't think so now. Um, I thought it was going to be the end. We were going to get through the ending, but um, turns out I took a different route that I wasn't meant to take. What level am I? I think I'm like 20, 20, uh, what, 25, 28, something like that. We're not going to do this in 10 turns. Not a chance. You thought it was over? Chat told me last night that I'd probably get to the end of the game within the next stream. So that's why I titled it Final. Okay, just keep attacking. It's because you thought I did the regular route? Ah, uh, okay. Next stream, the end, part two. The end, Redux. Yeah, we're never going to do this in, four, in like four turns. You say I've got to beat all of them in ten turns? Ain't no hope in hell. I mean, I'm not... Like, I would eventually kill this guy. He's not really that hard. He doesn't have that much damage output. It's more of a... He just soaks it up. But in 10 turns... Each one you have 10 turns. Oh, I thought you meant I had to do them all in 10 turns. Two turns left. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Stop. Hammer time. Timori does not that mean. I mean... Yeah, last turn. So what happens? Hey, Naily, I've arrived. A bit late, but you still arrive. Well, thank you, Naily. <laughs> so what happens when I'm out of turns? Do I just, do I just like, insta-die? Yep. Yeah. You're waiting for the stream all day. Oh, bless you. <laughs> Right, let's not retry just yet. How long you first play Earth Cube? You only played, you only have 120 ish health over your party. Oh, okay, yeah. So I'm level like 27, 26. I think if we optimize, we might might be able to do it if we like fully optimize. I'm not sure. 
Right, I'm going to go for another break, get myself a quick coffee, and then we'll decide what we're doing. Right, I'll be back in a minute. I'm sorry, what? 300 hours on one save? Wow. That's crazy. <sighs> okay, so do you think we can do this at this level? I can do it. Right, let's optimize our skills. 
So we can't sad him, so there's no point in having sad poem. Use better charms. Yeah, it might, might be the trick. So if we put that, we've got that contract. So the contract puts up everything, but leaves us super vulnerable. But Amori doesn't die first time. So if we put that on Amori, we've got at least one more turn to heal him. I reckon that's a shout. Contract. If we make everyone angry, so they have increased damage output, with the contract and red hands, No, because I wouldn't have enough juice to use red hands. Because it takes my juice right down to 34. Yeah, I've seen that. Okay. So maybe I've got the flower crown. So I want stuff to put my attack up, don't I? Use the eye patch. Or the cat ears. Eye patch goes to 83, cat ears. So I think it's eye patch or cat ears, isn't it? Eye patch brings down my hit rate though. Let's use the cat ears. Right, cat ears on the Mori. Aubrey. She already has the attack luck and increased hit rate. Hell. Foxtail. Increased speed. Well, that would be good with his um, hit and run. The running gun. Yeah. Okay. And Hero raises all stats by five. Use coffee as well, and you've got a Kel Nuke. <laughs> That's a good, good idea. Um, I don't really know what I want to... I think he's fine with the Rose Hair Clip. TBH. Right, skills. Be down, obviously. Attack that ignores a foe's defense, then reduces. Okay, we're going to go for that. Going to go for the power hit, for sure. Wind up throw possibly. Okay, what about Kel? What's Kel got? Can't catch me. Kerbal, Ricochet, Rally, Flex. Oh, we can go Flex into Run and Gun. Flex Coffee into Coffee Flex into Run and Gun. That might be. That might, that might be a play. That might be a play. Um. Um, look, instead of fast food, let's have a refresh to get some juice back. Okay, do you know what? Let's try this again. I think this is the first battle I've had to actually properly think about. But we're going in with a plan. 
going in with plan. <laughs> I believe! Right. We've got this. Ten turns. Let's go. Ten turns left. So, first turn, if we just... Sad poem... To get him out of afraid status... Everyone else can just attack. Right. Um, hang on a minute. I just want to see if... Can they use snacks? They can use snacks. Okay. So this turn, if we go skill, stare, Aubrey can use coffee, he can megaphone, um, he's going to have to just um, snack up a bit, have a hot dog, chill. Right, let's see how this works. Everybody angry. Shit, he one-tapped Kel. That was not in the plan. That was not in the plan. Okay, um... <laughs> This was not in the plan. Uh, let's get the power hit in. Jam up. Okay, uh, we can't red hands. Hack away for the three hits. Hit the beat down. Run and gun. Um, and let's try coffeeing again. Big hits, big hits. Jam him. Why is he one tapping us this time? Five turns left, we definitely have not got him down to half. Snack up. Let's get some let's get some juice back. Amori can't be afraid. Get wrecked. Skill red hands. Attack. Skill running gun again, I suppose. Um, skill snack time. Yeah, nearly got alt. Snack time! <laughs> uh, 
three turns left. I still don't think we're gonna do it. I still don't think we can have enough. Red hands. Um. Airhorn. Get everyone at Angie. And do you know what? I think I'm gonna snack time preemptively snack time again. <laughs> oh my god, Mori's hanging on. But like does give us the ult. And everyone's angry, so it should be a big, should be a big ult. Right, so we just need to attack, so... Oh, this is it, all or nothing, all or nothing. This is it. This is it. That was a big 1k damage. Last turn. Oh my god. This is so close. Yes! Did it. It was close. Amori learned Vertigo. Sorry, what? I'm sorry, what? Deals damage to all foes based on user speed and greatly reduces their attack. Okay. My speed is a lot higher than my attack. Right, let's save. <coughs> One down, let's save. Let's try the next one then, I suppose. Now is this the Spidey boss? Go. Okay, ten turns on this boy. Right, sad poem. To get him. Do you know what? No, let's just use an item. Let's just use an air horn. Excuse me. Um, that was No, stare. Stare first. 
now a hit. I run and gun it. And then we can snack time. Okay, we can't do this. We can't beat this one. We need to be a much higher level for this. I'm sh I'm like a hundred percent sure. I'm so glad I saved after that boss fight. Because there ain't no way we're doing this one. Ain't no way in hell. Let's go back to finding those keys, yeah? Let's go back to, let's go back to find those keys just just for now. We can come back here. It's fine. But there ain't no way in hell. I am beating that. Not a single chance. Hey. Ha <laughs> ha, glitched. Oh. We need a beach arc. Oh yeah, you see that thing about going to the beach, didn't you? I haven't been there yet. After we get this key, we'll I'll take I'll go to the beach. Because I don't think I've been there yet. Okay, so what was this key after coming out of the dungeon? Head up to find... Okay, hang on. Let me go back. Let me go back to the Google. Right, head right when you exit the dungeon area, and go through a big door. You'll be in the kitchen. So you need to come out of here and head right through a big door to the kitchen area. Got it. We got it. The castle music's very nice. Okay, so that's J got. What else do we need to get next? At the end of a plank. Q ah, and then plank. Frustratingly, this key is visible near the start of the game, but you can't actually reach it until you're near the end. In the last resort, you need to go up to the fourth floor by going through the hole in the first room you find. The fourth floor is under construction, but with ordinary skills, you'll be able to get the R key. Oh yeah, it's that one that I found that you see at the start of the game. 
Yes, I remember that now. Right, okay. Let's save. Yeah, the castle music's very nice. I mean, all the music in this game is very nice. My favorite Amori track? Um, hmm. <clears throat> It'll be one of the boss battles. I can't decide which one. Sprout more village song or the song that plays when you fight the slime girls. I was gonna say slime girl song that we had last last um stream. I, I really liked that song. Right, hang on. So false. Is it in Vast Forest this train? We're gonna go to this train just to make false happy. Yep. Okay, where's this train? Where the girls are going to the um food place. I oh, know he says there's a train that takes you to a beach. No, that goes up to somewhere else. Or is it the false? You're gonna have to give me directions or I'm gonna wander around aimlessly. Go left! Okay, left. Ah, train station, left. And then go up, okay. I must have been in this area before. Train station. I have been here. This is where the KK slider dude is. I got bunny ears. KK slider wanna be. I love it.
It is a lovely song. Stop right there! You can't pass without a... Well, that's a train pass. You must be the last passengers. I've been waiting for you for a very long time. Well, that's an okay from me. Welcome aboard, patrons. Hi. Run aboard the train? Yeah, why not? Here is not home, but where is home? Home is not here, but where is here? A case full of crosses. Here is not home. Here is not home. Where is home? Case full of crystals. Yeah, the music's so good. So interpretizing music on Dream World's all bright, yeah. It's like the music's outstanding. Um the lights go out. Oh god, they've all disappeared. What's going on? Case full of little bones. And I see the demons. Case full of spider webs. A bag full of dirt. Case full of crosses. Full of berry. Little bones. <laughs> This train goes on forever. Just <laughs> ro ro shaggy. <laughs> train is. Oh, hi there. Ah. <laughs> I think I fought one before, didn't I, in the library? Sunny. Take the red hands. Sunny, I'm sorry. Genuinely scared you when you knew that I was going Ladies and gents, we have arrived at our stop. Welcome to the Orange Oasis, where the moon shines brighter. Please exit the train in an orderly fashion. Thank you for your patronage, and please ride with us again. Yeah, because, you know, everyone wants to be my ghost dog. Toast. Okay. That's just... So, technically, it's just a load of dead bodies hovering. Okay. Orange Oasis, that's what it's called. Wizzy Whitney. Yeah, I'm pretty fast. Not as fast as a train. It's important to know your limits. Ah, <sighs> the weather's even hotter than before. Blue, he goes down easily. We can listen sometimes. That's someone with me. Everyone here is so different and interesting. Oh, not me, me different and interesting. Guava, I was waiting for the train for so long. I can't even remember why I wanted to come here. Looks like a pretty cool place. Turn, turn, job. Yeah, we do have to go to last resort later. It's always in this place. Dino's dig. Oh, okay, so I don't know when we're going to be able to finish this, because I'm streaming tomorrow, 
but I did have a plan to stream. I think there's a key here. Oh, is there? Cool. Say, so, I am streaming tomorrow. I did have a plan to stream um some tr a little bit of Trombone Champ and then Marvel Snap because it's new season in Marvel Snap, and I downloaded a load of cool songs on Trombone here. Trombone Champ. That I do need to play. Was I meant to stare at that intensely? Rain Town. No. We found Rain Town. Umbrella. No, I don't want to do any quests. I just. No. <laughs> just no. No side quests. We have things we're doing. We can't get sidetracked. Let's speak of a pair of twins who guard the orange oasis under their watchful eye. So that they have the power to raise the dead, among other things. I don't know if there's much truth about these legends, but wouldn't that be interesting? So you think there's a key here, but we'll have to um, see if we can find it. Lots of side quests here. Oh, it's a sad little whirlpool. I got quick sanded. Ignoring your sign. You should have listened. <laughs> oh, this sounds pretty hype. One more fun fact about this area. Go for it. I do love my fun facts. I've never been to Rain Town. <laughs> How um I can't yeah, I'm not doing that. How am I finding all these things that the music that plays when you fall down out of the whirlpool is called pranked. It's number sixty nine the OST. <laughs> Pretty cool. <laughs> I need to change. Maybe I could have that as a as a, um, a channel point reward. You pay X amount of channel points, and you get to rename Buttspot to whatever word you want it to be. That might be fun. I actually might do some streams at some point, messing around with channel rewards and things. Um, it's a toast ghost. Um, yeah, just like messing around with channel point rewards and stream a bot to do really cool things. I've got so many ideas of really cool things. I've got an, I'll tell you what I have got an idea of. An idea of making something so that YouTube chat can fight Twitch chat. It, and it could be like a little fighting mini game and you control it by putting inputs in the chat and then it'd read it and yeah, it's an idea. I think it'd be pretty fun if I can pull it off. I'm pretty sure I can pull it off. I just need to work out a couple of things, but I think I can pull it off. How are you doing, Ruthius? 
Welcome in, my dude. That would be fun. I reckon I could pull it off. I just need to... Not funny. <laughs> Gonna beat Twitch chat so hard. <laughs> Good to go back from seeing a back specialist. I hope it went well. And getting the day off. I mean, day off's always good. Any excuse for a day off is a bonus. Yeah, I think I should be able to make that work. Like, I don't know coding or anything like that, so I'm having to do it a very simple way. I'm sure someone who, like, knew coding could just go, done. Um, but I don't, so I'm having to, like, find a way around certain things, which I'm, I'm pretty sure I can do. You did it! <laughs> really, just moving up back here. Uh, I went good. So then back looks normal. I probably have a little bit of arthritis in my left hip. So we're doing physical therapy for physical therapy for a little bit. Nothing improves. Getting an MRI. Well, that's good that you've got a plan in place. That was really good. I am happy for that. I got a conjure map. The bunny designs are so cute. Check out the new. He's up here, I mean. But yeah, like this thing I'm thinking it'd work in a similar way to my Twitch control Twitch and YouTube control Pokemon. Cause I have made it in the past where like I've made it so on my break Twitch can use commands to play the original Pokemon. Which was really fun. So it kind of works in a similar kind of way to that. We could do we could do a stream. Twitch plays Amori. Twitch or well, Twitch and YouTube plays Amori. What up, adventurers? Did you hear? We beefed our critters to be bigger and badder than ever before. Now you know what that means. More EXP. Come on, adventurers! What are you waiting for? Embarking on Dinotastic adventure today. Oh, this is like a grinding area then. Oh, nuts. I'm one dino dollar away from a silver spoon. Digs. How do I get digs? These long neck big dino boy. Love the stream went from finishing the game to finding secret. Finishing <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Ultimate treasure hunting you can experience a low price of 100 clans. Should we dig for, let's dig for some treasure? Why not? There's too many things to get sidetracked side by in this goddamn game. <laughs> Alright, kiddos, first things first. Here at Dying Dig, we dig with spoons. So you don't have a spoon? I'll give you a potato spoon for free. You got a potato spoon. Yay! Choose which spoon you like to use a potato spoon. There you go, right on, brother. You're a quick learner, aren't you? In our special big site, the Food Pyramid, you'll be able to uncover super rad treasure from all over the universe. And the best place you get to keep anything you find. That's a dino guarantee. Let me tell you about our dig site. The Food Pyramid has four levels. You'll always start on the first level, but if you're lucky, you might just find a pyramid key that unlocks the pyramid gate to the next level. The higher you go, the better the treasure will be. Now here's the catch. Each spoon has a limited amount of uses before it breaks. For example, potato spoons will break after you dig five times. If your spoon breaks, the treasure hunt ends. The pyramid gates close and will call you back to the entrance. You understand everything? Yes. 
Dino-tastic. Now it's time for Dino Disclaimer. Try something the only thing you'll find in this food pyramid. During your round, you might find some troublesome critters looking for a fight. We are liable for any damages to you or your property during the adventure, you dig? If a critter needs to during battle, it'll be real game over. Well, that's pretty much it. All's left you do is go upstairs. Some of the food pyramid there and start digging. Have a Dino-tastic adventure. I... I got a dino dollar. I got a dino dollar. I got a dino dollar. All I'm finding so far is dino dollars. Yeah, hey, I found ramen. And a hot dog. Another spoon bite the dust. Big spoon down, that's game over. Okay, well, that looked pretty cool. Right, okay. Is there a key in this area? We, we're here to find key. We, we need to find keys. That's what we're meant to be doing. Is there a key in this area or not? Hey, at least we can come back here easy. We're gonna key this real quick. Thank you. Much appreciated. Big preach. Mango movie. Nice. Large face, these. Hollow spaces I mark. In them. I have hidden my most precious belongings, yes. I smash my face to remember, but lightly. Any harder and it would break. Smash. Any harder. And it would break. Is that what I'm meant to be doing? Smashing these faces? So that's what the faces were all about. Ooh, jam pack, it's nice. In that digging game, there's one. Okay. Guess we go back to the digging game then. I've got three dino doors. I can get a spoon for that, can't I? Yeah. Sick choice. I think there's one new one of them can things. Okay. So false says there's one in the digging game. Plastic spoon time. I found Hector! Oh, Hector! Could it be? Is it really you? Come on, Hector. Back in my pocket you go. You're just like old times. I completely forgot about this side quest. Ah, Kel, my old friend. Holy shit, the stone talks. I'm so sorry. I'm afraid things have changed and I can no longer accompany you. You see... I have family now. <laughs> Wait. Hector Jr.? What are you doing? You saying you want to join them? There's more to life than just staying here? Oh, Hector Jr., I I understand you well. Even this old stone knew how to have fun once. May you all have memorable adventures together. Go on, join him, Hector Jr., into his pocket. You got Hector Jr. <laughs> okay. Yep, yeah, just like that. I guess that's farewell then. Thank you for never giving me Cal. Finding me, Cal. Hector Jr., you'll be good, okay? Don't forget your family. We're always here for you. Hope the next time we meet, you'll have flourished into a wonderful polished rock. Don't worry, Hector. I'll take good care of Hector Jr. I know you will, Kel. Don't lose him this time, alright? I won't. I promise. Wow, that was... totes emotion. That was a highly emotionally charged... Got a dino dollar. Got some chocolate. Let's 
so emotional. Oh, okay, these guys are actually... Oh, wow, oh, okay, these guys are actually hard. Fine, hack away. All the slicings. Apparently the baseball bat is a boomerang as well. I respect that. Attack again! The strawberry snake. Oh god, it's nearly midnight. We're gonna have to, I'm gonna have to bounce in a minute. Um, so yeah, it looks like we're gonna be doing a Mori, um... Next Monday as well. What I might do is, I might off-stream, I might collect all the keys apart from Zed. So, when we stream Monday, we've got the keys and we're ready to... ready to go. I'm getting all the dino dollars here. Got bread. Get that bread. I got ancient code. Hey, a pyramid key. Ah, oh, but the spoon. This spoon broke. What's the ancient code for? Interesting. Right, let's go save and call a night. With the Patreon blanket, it's just down here. No, no, no. The boss fight in here as well. Oh. Where's the picnic blanket? Eh. Okay, I'm sure I saw a picnic blanket here somewhere. Maybe while I find the keys I can level up, yeah. I think I shall. I think I shall. Okay, was there no save thing here? In this area? There must be. He's a burning man. That was a jump scare. Oh, it's a shame I can't save in here. Yeah, let's keep grinding that dino digs area. Okay, seriously, was there no save up here? In this area? Love to him! It's an orange house. Got blood orange. Yeah, there is one here. I'm sure it's... I know I've seen it somewhere. Oh, was it down by the train? I think it might be down by the train. Oh, no, there it is. <laughs> hey, I found it. Right, that's the save. Okay. 
So we'll probably play this again next Monday. Do our normal Monday Mori. Um, yeah, I'm gonna offline. I'm gonna level up a bit, find the keys apart from Z, and then like when we hit stream Monday, we can just go get the Z key, get all that done. Um, hopefully, grind up a bit, do those three bosses, and then do everything else. Um, I will be back on tomorrow night, same time, 9 p.m. GMT. Uh, we'll be playing some Trombone Champ. So, if there's any Trombone Champ songs you want me to play or have a go at, just let me know either on Twitter, Discord, YouTube community, wherever you want to message me. Um, yeah. I'm going to do that, and then we're going to do some Marvel Snap, because I am obsessed with that game. And I want to try out some new decks with Black Panther. You'll miss the Trombone Champ stream. Oh, no. Well, see, that's the great thing about me dual streaming to YouTube. You can just hop onto my YouTube and watch it whenever you want. Easy. Anyway, take care, everyone. Thank you for hanging out tonight. Um, and I'll see you tomorrow night. Take care. Bye-bye.